Welcome to our course on building a blackjack application from scratch. Within this course, we're going to go through step by step how to build an application from scratch, including all of the HTML, CSS, and JavaScript that's required in order to build this application. My name is Lawrence and I'm going to be your instructor for this course. I'm so excited to have this opportunity to present this course to you today. So I've been building web applications since 99, so it's quite a while I've been building web applications and I really enjoy working with JavaScript. It's amazing the really cool things that you can do with JavaScript. And in this course, I'm going to be demonstrating some of the functionality that JavaScript has to offer. So this is going to be a simple HTML page with some CSS styling and then JavaScript to top it off and create all of the logic and game interactions. So we're going to be building out a dashboard using HTML, including dealer's hand, player's hand, and we've chosen Blackjack as the actual game application because the rules in Blackjack are fairly straightforward. One of the most important things to do when you're coming in and you're designing your game, you want to make sure that the game rules are nice, neatly set out, and that they actually work. So the player can interact with the game and they can have a pleasant experience. And one of the reasons why we apply CSS is really to bring that styling to the users. So in the course, I'm going to be showing you how to create a nice looking playing card in order to be presented within our HTML dashboard. So this is one of these features within the game that it's great to take that those extra steps to make that game as realistic as possible. And because it's blackjack, we needed cards and we're gonna build out a card using CSS. Also, the main driver and the main engine behind everything within this application is JavaScript. So JavaScript is going to be doing all of the heavy lifting, all of the logic, and doing all of the really amazing things that are going to be created within this application. So this is a sample of the application that we're going to be building out. And as we can see, we walk in, we start the game, uh, we have ability, to, we've got our total amount, we're able to, to bet a certain amount and then we've got our dealers value and we've got our players hand value we've got the values being displayed and for those of you that are not familiar with blackjack the objective of blackjack is to get to 21 or uh, beat and to beat the dealers hand uh, so you can take cards don't if you go over 21 then you lose and the whole idea with blackjack is to make your bets, do them strategically, and take a look at the cards that are played out and apply your logic and your strategy within the hands. So we can see here that the dealer's hand, uh, one card is hidden, one card is shown. We know that they've got at least a 10. If this is another high card, then more than likely they're gonna beat us. So the idea here is to hit, and we see that we took a seven so we ended up with a total of 21 so that looks pretty good to me so now we're just going to do a hold but unfortunately the dealer got 21 and we lost our amount so we lost five dollars our total went down to 95 now we can increase our bet if we want to bet 95 we can deal it out again uh, we can hit and we can hold and this time we actually beat the dealer so the dealer ended up with 17 we ended up with 21 and we can keep continue to deal out uh, continue to apply that strategy with the betting and with the actions within the game in order to get as much money as possible. So at the end of the day, objective as Blackjack is to grow your total and end up with as much money as possible. So again, it's going to be JavaScript that's going to be doing all of the heavy lifting and the calculations and where we're going to apply logic. And this game is going to be built out entirely from scratch, step by step. And the whole concept of this course is to introduce you to how to build out a game, how to think it through, how to apply that logic, and really make JavaScript work. Objective is to keep and see JavaScript in action and build out a game from scratch. So when you're ready, let's begin coding and creating this applica application.